Why do you think that the generation of young teenage girls is so difficult? Why so many young teenage girls struggle with low self-esteem and feeling inadequate and feeling ugly? Well, there's many different reasons. I made a video last week talking about Am I Pretty or Ugly? The girls, the young girls who post videos of themselves asking people on YouTube if they're ugly or pretty. That video can be find, found right up in this corner. But today, I'm covering a new topic. Today, I'm covering the television show known as Toddlers and Tiaras, Tiaras, however you say it. This is one of these television shows that makes me clench my fist every time I see an advertisement for it or any time I see it on television. For those of you who don't know what this show is, it is a show where mothers of typically a single daughter, an only child, takes their daughter between the ages of three and seven, dresses them up, usually very provocatively, if a young three or four year old can be dressed up provocatively, shows as much skin as they can on their daughter, and then puts them on stage, tries to make them look like a plastic Barbie doll model, or celebrities, and it results in a competition. Who is the beauty queen? Who is the beauty queen among all these young little girls? And they all compete by their dress, their style, how they walk, um, who shows more skin than the other girls. It's kind of like America's Top Model, except with young, 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 very little, small children. Children who haven't even developed cognitive abilities to comprehend what they're fully um, doing and how it's going to affect them in the long run. Pretty sad, isn't it? That little girl on stage with a little mini skirt showing off as much skin as she can, complains that she didn't win first place. Why, where do you think she developed this mentality? The mentality that she has to win, that she has to show off her body, that she has to act a certain way on stage to present herself. What this show ultimately boils down to is bad parenting. Or no, I shouldn't even say bad parenting. It is what is known as fail parenting. F a I L. Fail parenting. We wonder why girls struggle with self esteem in their teenage years. It's because of shows like this, which are being developed and instilling an image that these young girls, only at five, six years old, have to be for the rest of their life. And the worst part of it is the mother is the person who is influencing this mentality and this lifestyle of the girl. And if there's any person who has a greater influence, it is the parents who have the influence on the children. Toddlers and Tierras is a disgusting, repulsive television show. I don't blame the children. I blame the source, which is the mother. The mother of these young daughters. You wonder why young girls are wearing more and more revealing clothing when they're only six, seven years old? It's because of a show like this. The source is the mother. But do you know what I think? Any mother who puts her child on toddlers and tiaras, tiaras, she is exploiting her daughter using her body to gain fame and money and make sure they win a competition. But the biggest problem I have about this show is that the mother is building upon her own self-ego. The mother of toddlers and tiaras don't truly know how to love their child in a way in which they were loved at a young age. So therefore, they look at their young child as someone that they wish they could have been at that age. So they used their daughter to shape and mold what they wanted to be when they were in their teenage years. It ultimately is an ego problem of the parents. They're using their child to build and shape the ego they didn't have when they were that age. Not only is this one of the most selfish things the parent can do, but it is instilling an image and lifestyle that this young girl is going to live for the rest of her life un unless her mother matures and realizes what she's doing to her daughter. But you want to know why these young teenage girls are going to struggle with low self-esteem when they hit their teenage years? Partially it's because of their mother. 
No, actually, it's not partially. It's all because of their mother. Because their mother hasn't been there for them in the position of what a mother needs to do. To love their child and accept their child for who they are and tell that child that you are beautiful for who you are and that you don't need to put your face up, up with makeup and look like a plastic Barbie doll in order for people to like you, in order for people to clap for you, in order for people to accept you, in order for people to love you. Do you get my point? She's going to grow up in her teenage years thinking that she has to be this... This, this identity that she grew up with. She has to have a perfect looking body. She has to have a perfect looking face. She has to have the perfect hair. She has to walk the perfect walk. She has to be that model. She's not going to know what true beauty is. The only beauty she knows is the conditional beauty that her mother taught her. And if I have any of those f freaking mothers watching this video right now, this is a message for you. You may have never had a great childhood, but for you as a parent to exploit your daughter, to build an image that she has to meet for the rest of her life, is not only wrong, it's shameful. You're not a parent. You are an egotistical, selfish, self-absorbed mother who really cares about herself and her own ego not your child. You're teaching your child to look at outward beauty and never, ever, inward beauty. And for that, I don't call you a parent. I call you a disgrace. This is really how we live.